Wow, there are a lot of decorations. It's plushween. <laughs> Sorry. Turn on the throat. Okay, are we ready? Counting it down. Plush, plush, plush play games. Wait a second, I said that by myself. <laughs> Sorry about that. Mimi wasn't totally ready, but that's okay. We can just keep going. Okay, I'm down. Okay. Huh? Uh, uh, hello, everybody. I am Com Com Galbert. Hello, I am Big Bunny. And these are, this is my friend, Mimi. Mimi is Mimi Vilbert Gilbert, and we are Plush Play Games. And today we are playing something that we can't see because this, this thing went away. Oh no. One second. I'm getting, uh, I'm getting some uh, input from the control room. I'm told this is Halloween Hangman. Ooh, that sounds fun. Halloween Hangman. And, um, uh, oh, we are playing this on primarygames.com. Uh, so, uh, 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 so let's get straight into it. <laughs> there's, a, there's a skull in front of Mimi. <laughs> okay, what is the purpose of this game? We have to figure out. Uh, what these five letters are by clicking on letters down below. Boy, that ghosty looks pretty. Everyone looks mad on this. Not cemetery, though. So, uh, I suggest we buy bow. I believe that's an excellent plan. Okay, there's an O. Okay, we have an O and an E. Uh, then, then, uh, probably not a lot more vowels in there. Let's try a letter that's common, like S. They say it S is very common. Maybe read something about this somewhere, and then like maybe M. Ah, uh, I'd say go with a T. Ooh, everything got a little uh, pixelated there. It does. It gets pixelated. Um, we could try L. Okay, we're not doing this too well. What's it's an O and E S. Um, Mimi thinks maybe. Oh no, Mimi feels very much pressured. What about an R? Oh no, it's getting all pixelated on us. Okay, we have to think this through. I still say M or N. Uh, well, let's go with the N. Okay. Oh, 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 it's owns. Oh, uh, 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 I do know this one. It starts with a B, which for like Big Bunny, which would be a B, it's bones. So I wonder what would happen if we totally messed it up. Ooh, this is a witch. Hmm. Let's once again start with an E. Oh, no E's. Let's go for I because it's witchy. No eyes. We have to find what letter's in there. Oh, there's an O. And there's no E's. E's are such a common thing. I don't think there's any U's. Let's try an A. This one's tough. Go for the S. Oh my gosh, whatever it is, it's probably plural. Which is very unfortunate because it makes it... Oh no, we're getting really uh, pixelated here, girls. H seems to be a common letter. No. We don't have much to go on. This is not looking promising. It's not looking good at all. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. They got two L's. Ah, uh, Halloween or something? No, nope, there's the H. Well, I know a word called gallows. Oh my gosh, it's going to be gallows. That's just terrible. Why would they have that on this Halloween game? I don't know. I don't even want to talk about it in front of the kids. So we'll just pretend gallows didn't exist. Hey, there's a witch on a broom with a cat. That's such a cute cat. It's a cute cat too. Okay, um, let's go for the E's again. Oh no, no E's in this one. Let's go for the O's. No O's. Oh my. Uh, let's go for the eyes. Oh, there's an eye. What can possibly be with one eye? I say go for the S, of course. No S's. T? No T's. This one is going to stump us, girls. Mimi knows. Mimi can't figure out all we have is an I. No S, no T. Uh, N? No N! Oh my gosh, girls. We are not doing well. What could it possibly be? Let's go for the R. No R's. These are the most common letters in the used in words. No H's. Oh my gosh, we are going to fail. Mimi thinks we're going to lose the game. Mimi really does. We're running out of letters, too, which is not very good. What could it possibly be? Something with an I near the end of it. Well, shall we go with an A? Oh, there's an A and an I. Ooh, 
I really feel like we should stop and look and try to figure this one out with, before we go any farther because it's very hard to do. I can't figure this one out. Mimi doesn't know and Mimi was feeling smart. Do you think it's fairy? Oh no, because there'd be a wah or wah. Good try though. Sorry. No, no, that was a good try. What are some Halloween things that can have an A and an I in it and nothing else? Because there's no other letters in it. Happy Halloween. Mimi has a feeling if we hit one more wrong letter, it will totally fail. And I have no idea what letter to hit. Anybody? Z. No, let's go for L. Oh, it was magic! But it didn't fail. Let us go on to the next one. Back in the cemetery. I know. Etta would love the cemetery. Let's go for the E. No E. Let's go for the O. No O. Let's go for the A. No A's. Let's go for the I. Oh, silly. Seriously. What could this possibly be? None of those. No vowels in it. Mimi doesn't know. Why? No Y's. Oh, my gosh. Well, there can only be a U. Oh, boy. <laughs> This is a hard one as well because all we have is you and we wasted all of our guesses on them. Oh my. S with a U. S U. S U. S shum. Shum. What is it? Stump. Stump. It's stumping us. Stump. No, it's not a stump. Wait a second. Uh. Uh, oh, oh Squat. Mimi! No, no, Mimi knows it! Mimi knows it! Mimi knows it! <laughs> oh my gosh, Mimi, that was skull. excellent! It was a skull! Well, Mimi is sitting right behind a skull, see? So Mimi looked at the skull and thought, maybe it's a skull! Very good job, Mimi! Seriously! Really, really good job! This is harder than Mimi thought it was going to be. I agree. Oh, there's another black kitty cat, too! <sighs> so now we're back to trying to guess... Okay, we have an I. No O's or A's. Oh my. Oh my. Let's try for an R. S. Ah! Some of these words are really hard. It seems like the shorter they are, the harder they are. So we have something with an I. Oh, did we try E? No E's! Oh my. So we have something once again with one vowel and a whole bunch of consonants, and none of them are S. T. Oh, 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 I have it. I have it. It is a witch. It is definitely a witch. This time it's a witch. We got it. Oh, my. Oh, Ooh, there are three witches on this one. Let's go for the common ones that we uh, sometimes don't get. No. Oh. Ah. Ah. One vowel again. What is with these weird vowel things? I have no idea. Ugh. So frustrating. How can nothing be in there? A U and an I. Look at the background. Oh my, I got this one. I know this one. Look at the background. I got this one. I got it. I know these things. I know these things. I am a vegetable after all. Oh, good job. Good job. Good job. It's a pumpkin. It has nothing to do with the background, unfortunately. Now, there are pumpkins and bats in a cemetery. I bet you it's not bats or pumpkins, though. Okay, there's an O in this one. I'm so glad I got the pumpkin. I was starting to feel kind of not smart. <sighs> Hangman can get you every time. Okay, there's an A and an O in it. Oh, that's a weird combination. Mimi agrees. That one's weird. Of course, Mimi said they're all weird. We've had a lot of N's. Oh, there's an N in this one. Okay, so there's an A and an O and an N. What can we go between that A and that O? That's not a T. Pun. Run. Ron. Alon. Oh, my. This is hard. I agree, it is difficult. Oh, an R went in it. Mm. Oh, I think I got this one, though. It doesn't make sense. Why would it be a dragon for Halloween? How many dragons are there in Halloween? I don't know. It's quite, quite a spooky tree, though. It is. It is a ghosty with a pumpkin, and it's five letters. Okay, let's try this again. It's an O. It seems like there's an awful lot of O's in these Halloween words, does it not? 
It does. There's like a lot of O's. Let's see if there's an S. Oh, an O and an S. T. Oh, it's a ghost. It's definitely a ghost. Sometimes you hit it right. Look, we didn't get any wrong letters on that one, girls. I'm going for an A. Yep, I know what this one is. No, I thought it was going to be a bat. Maybe it's going to be a cat. It's not a cat or a bat. Maybe it's a hat. No, it's not a hat. I thought I knew this one. Let's see if there's a T in there. There's no T in there. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we have an A and nothing else. Oh, no S's. What else could it be? It's not a bat, a hat, or a cat. But what else could it be? Because they're all wearing hats and they look quite happy. Hmm. Try Y. Nope, no Y's. L. Now I'm just randomly hitting letters. Dark! I don't think I would ever have gotten that one. Ooh, this tube says, says R.I.P. Etta would love that one. She would. She would love it a lot. Etta, there's a tombstone with an R.I.P. on it and lots of ghosties. Oh, my God! I mean, I mean all my graveyard. <laughs> Let's spook narrator with it. And then how we grab Mickey and then chew off narrator's toes. No, go away, Etta. We're not <laughs> chewing off anyone's toes. Except we're, for narrator's. We're trying to figure things out. This one's hard. They're all, they've all been rather hard. Oh, something that begins with an S and has an E in it, but we don't have any other vowels. Uh, oh, an A. Have we seen this one before? Mimi thinks it looks somewhat familiar. Um, it can't be a plur at the end, so something has to come after that E. That makes sense. I have no idea. Uh, why am I feeling like it's an L? Nope. We're going to lose this one too. Mimi's not happy. We're not losing again. Oh. Oh. I, I have it. It's scared. That's the only thing that made sense with the E there. Oh no. Oh my. It ends with an A. There are not too many words that end with an A. That is going to be quite interesting. Let's try for the T. Yes. None of these have the common letters. Ooh, there's an R. And it ends with an A. How many words end with an A when it has an R in it? Rah. Rah. Mimi's trying to figure this one out. Uh, uh, what can be on the other side of that A? Or the S? P R S R S R P R R Nope, it wasn't the Br Pr Fr Fr Gr Oh, we know it's not Zr Vir Vr 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 Pr it's only few that it could be. Okay, we have a rack now. Shrac. Oh! Mimi has it. <laughs> Dracula. <laughs> See, sometimes you just have to get some of the letters. Wow, this thing keeps going on and on and on. Does it ever end? I do not know. I do not know. It seems like... Bill! It's oh! It's a Scully. Hi, Scully. We're trying to play a game here. Hi. I'm being Jamie Rod this year. Oh, Scully's dressed up as uh, plush ninja warrior uh, Jamie Swan. Nice to see you, Scully. Hi. Thank you for visiting the set. You're welcome. Uh, oh, look, close your eyes and count to ten, everyone. Okay, our eyes are as close as they get. One, two, three. He's gone. Okay, back to our game. It's a couple eyes. We have a couple eyes. Oh, and there's an R in the middle of them. Let's go for the S. Oh, it starts with an S. It has an eerie in it. Siri. I believe that's the iPhone um, uh, interface. <sighs> we'll try. Maybe start to figure out what goes between the S and the I. Scary. Steery. Sphery. Sagiri. Sheery. Jerry, scary, sleary, smeary, sneery, sp 
spirit. Ah, spirit. <laughs> that, that was very good deduction on Mimi. Sometimes you just have to go through them. Wow, this looks like a family portrait, doesn't it? It does. Mimi thinks they look happy. There's a ghosty, a witchy, a vampire, and a Z. They look like a happy family now. They do. They seriously do. And they have an O in their word. And an I in their word. See if they have an S in their word. Or a T. Mimi noticed there's not a lot of S's and T's in these Halloween words. I oh, know. There's like a lot of weird things. Like a lot of weird things. R. No R's. Once again, it's a difficult one. Oh, there's a B. There's a B in a weird place. Bit. Hot bit. No, nope, can't be a T. Big. B a bid. Biff. Big. I feel like we should try. Okay, it wasn't big. What can it be? Bim. Bin. Bip. <laughs> Bip. <laughs> That's what the humans do. Biz. What can it be? It seems like that one should be figure outable, but it's just not. Can't be a Y. No, I know. It can't be a W. It doesn't make it be. It can't be uh, X. It could be Z. Biz. It's not a bim. It's not a. It could be a bin. It could be a bid. Nope. This. Oh. Oh my dear. Narrator's not gonna like this one, so we'll just skip it. It's the Z word. Okay. How many more are we going to do? I do not know. I thought maybe the game would end, but it doesn't seem to be ending at all. And this one doesn't seem to have any vowels in it. I know. What is it with these things with no vowels? I mean, what kind of words have no vowels? These words. I think we're going to lose on this one because we're just hitting around in the dark and it's not working. No vowels. Oh, there's a Y at the end of it with a U in the middle. Mimi doesn't know this one. And Mimi thinks we have one more shot and it's going to X us out. Let's go for the R. Mommy! Oh, all we needed was M's. Oh, I feel so bad we didn't get that because Mimi's so sweet. We should have gotten that one. I oh, know, I feel really guilty we didn't get it. I swear, hitting vowels is useless. Ooh. Also, ooh. Boot. Spook. No, it's nothing to the boo. Oh, my word, we're going to get this one wrong, too. Oh, these ones with only a few letters are so hard. There's two O's in it. How many words have two O's in the middle? I can think of pull. <sighs> Uh, I was thinking maybe good, like good witch, bad witch, but it's not that as well. Roof. Uh, poof. Moon. Ah, uh, my goodness, we just aren't doing good with these words at all. I mean, not at all. Some of these are really hard. I'm surprised we're doing so bad. I thought we we're going to do really good at this because we have a lot of brain power here. We do have a lot of brain power. Maybe, maybe we should call Mimi's hotline. It wouldn't help. Mimi's having a hard time with this. That one was cats, though, but we just stumbled on that one. I oh, know. We should have got that one because we have a lot of cats here. We should have figured that one out. Ooh, something with E's. Uh, no R's. S. T. Oh, boy. Oh, I got this one. Good job, my friend. Good job. It's a skeleton. See, every once in a while you can see them, but most of the time you just can't see them. And we actually have a full size skeleton laying on uh, the sister narrator's bed right now. Seriously. Shall I mean, it did come from a human. It's, it's all plastic. 
If you're okay with this, we're gonna lay down uh, this on the floor right here so we can tape it on easier. No, no, seriously, give me a real thing, like a real word. Yes. Okay. Um, 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 yes, we have skeletons here. Um, and we have a full-size skeleton here in the house, but it's plastic. Anyone know what's inside this coffin, right? Huh? Probably something spooky. It's probably, I, I know what it is, it's money. Is it? Just look inside. There's nothing in there. Okay, it's another one with two <laughs> O's in it. What is up with these Halloween words and lots of O's? <laughs> and now there's a T. Okay. Boot. It's a shun word. It's a potion. It's potion. It's potion. It's a shun word. Oh, thank goodness we got a word we can recognize. Seriously. No, the one we thought was boots was actually moon. We totally got it wrong. So which way does it lay? This way or? That way. Okay, we have an E. No I's. No A's. See, that's the, the thing. We keep using our, our vowel sounds. Wonder if this one's bones again. It's bones again. We've come back to the beginning. Oh, we have. We made it through. Okay. Does it just keep going like nonstop? I think it does. I think it does. I think it does. Now we can just spell them out like we're smart. Well, we are smart. We just got stumped a few times. That was Halloween. Well, I guess we should end it. Let's pick a pic cute picture to end it on. Okay, well, I think this is a wonderful picture to end it on. I think we did pretty well. I have no idea how many we, we did, but it was a lot of fun. It was working the noodle. <laughs> or the brain. Hi, Scully. Wow. Scully's back. Hi, Scully. Where'd you go to say goodbye? Ah, uh, no, it's a nice Jamie Ron costume. Yes, he'd probably get tickled about that. Tickled, well, green. <laughs> um, okay, um, make, uh, make sure you hit the like button, which looks like this. And subscribe to our channel today. And then you have to please watch uh, 30, sec 30 seconds of our ads this time, anytime. Then please bring your friends over for a small, oh gosh, I forgot, makeover. And give them a big movie theater. I always love the way you do that one. And then Mimi, uh, thank you for coming here and watching us today on Plush Play Games, part of our Plushaween celebration. This was a Halloween hangman. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed it and you enjoyed our decorations and Scully and everybody else. And now, uh, anyway, here at Plush Play Games, we bring you plushy fun because we bring the smile to your day. We bring the laughter to your life. We bring the happiness to our games. And we bring the smoochies to your corny. And Mimi means love couple. Smoochies, corny. Make sure you come back tomorrow for more plushy fun here on Plush Play Games. Meanwhile, you can check out our website at www.plushplaygames.com. It'll lead you to... www.plushplaygames.com. Wow, that came out of nowhere. That was kind of cool. Oh, there's a skeleton, too. And uh, so anyway, uh, um, the, uh, and then um, our website will take you to our sister channel, which is Etsy's 5-Minute Films. And uh, Etsy's 5-Minute Films is now active and posting, so I highly recommend you check it out for some more uh, plushy fun. And um, please check out probably one of our newest videos, Mimi's Hotline. Mimi gets to do a hotline. <laughs> Mimi can't wait to do a hotline. They're working on Mimi's set right now. Um, because uh, uh, there's a lot of set building. Uh, yeah, uh, Etsy's five minute films. It's short films. And in those short films, we cover any. Where's the clear tape? Uh, I do not know. Oh, um, uh, we were saying Etsy's five minute films. We could do anything on there. We, it might be Mimi's Hotline or Com Com's movie spoilers or Super Corn. Uh, or there's Cooking with Corny and there's uh, Skull with uh, Com Com, I think. And then there's Et Etta's uh, Fairy Tales. And, and Mimi's uh, Dating Tips and um, oh, parodies. We do tons of parodies. And um, oh, coming up is going to be Plush Ninja Warrior. Oh, oh, and there's going to be the Pelican Brief. So lots of fun stuff there. It's just anything we want to make it to a five minute film, we do. So come on out and check out our fun, 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 comedy, fun, and parodies and fun. So anyway, thank you so much for coming here. Mimi's going to send something special to all of you out there and be her very special smoochies. Bye, everybody. Oh. Goodbye. It's been a pleasure. Bye. Goodbye. Bye.